Hello YouTube, this is the Center Center. And today, hey, hold on. And today I will show you, in a continuation of the last video, how to download ROMs for your emulators. As you can see, these games I have, and these two down here, these Mario games, are actually not for the Game Boy Advance. One's for Game Boy, and the, the Super Mario World 2 is, of course, for SNES. But, you have to download all of the ROMs through the Game Boy Advance ROM um, emulator, or you can't... Or there's no other way to download it, the other ROMs for the other emulators. You gotta first download the Game Boy Advance, then you choose this up here in the corner, It'll go to the ROMs list. You choose the game you want, the system. I choose, um, I'm going to use an example, the um, Super Nintendo. Let it load. Alright. Choose by letter. I'm going to find the Super Mario World 1 as an example. No, you shouldn't go too fast. Go on down the list. Alright. Hold on. Lots of supers. There we go. Super Mario World. Choose the first one. There you go. See? Emulator required to play install the SNES for iOS, which is the one we're using, on a non jailbroken device. You must change your phone date back to July 13th. I mean, before, you know, you must change it back to your modern day time in 2013, or else it won't work. Scroll down to the bottom, choose to download now, as if you would on your actual computer emulator. Let it load. Brings up this. Download in the GBA for iOS. If it does not say that there, you'll click on this one here. This one on the side, and it comes up lists of things to use. Choose that. It'll transfer to this. And there it is. Super Mario World. An added edition. And here's how you play it. As you can see, this is a Game Boy Advance. It will not work on that. I'll go ahead and show you an example. This is Game Boy Advance SP. It is not going to work. That's not going to work on it. So, we'll go to the emulator for iOS. I um, added mine to home page. It made it a lot easier. As you can see, you have to set your date back to 2012 now. It can be complicated sometimes. That's why I would actually recommend by downloading more than one game per time and then doing this part. Because if you don't, it's going to get a lot harder. It's going to be a lot more confusing. But this is just an example for you all. Scroll down. Choose this, and again, don't forget to set it back once, it, once you change it. Go down, choose the, um, do not choose the NES for iOS, it should not work. You choose the SIOS, which is the newer version, I believe, and it will say this, install, it goes to mains, XR, brings it here, and then you, it, you see, as you can see, the Game Boy Advance has been replaced. It'll load. There you go. Choose it. And now you can now you're allowed to play those two games. Choose Super Mario World. That's the one I downloaded as an example. As you can see the sound is not that great. So actually I would advise you just to turn the sound off while you're doing this, or at least very low. Like that. See the buttons, controls, and see it works. So I just wanted to uh, show you this as an example. And unlike every, see, just like every game um, that you'll be downloading on any console from the emulators available, this, whiz, this is a um, one thing. So, uh, let's see, SNES, Nintendo DS, uh, NES, 
Game Boy, the Color, the original Game Boy, those games have to be downloaded through the Game Boy Advance or else it will not uh, work. It will not work. You have to download it through the Game Boy Advance, then change your date back to 2012, then go, then you can go back to the emulator thing, emulator for iOS, EMU for iOS, I showed you in my last video, and choose it, and download whichever console you want for that game you've already downloaded. And it should work perfectly. Is it an example? It works. I actually have this on a real SNES system. This Mario game. I actually have a real SNES system. I guess I could show you if you wish. In a little while, I guess I could... You know what? Actually, if you really want to see it right now, I guess I could show you. Sorry, that may have been a glare there. Not sure if it was or not. But, um, I may or may not be making a card channel next weekend. This will be just an exam, just something, just I figured I'd say that. And, on that card channel, I am going to be opening a, or at least my brother will be, who turns out he's been my cameraman this whole time. And he will be making a booster box opening, plasma freeze booster box opening, next Friday. So I hope you guys look forward to that. And I guess I will see you later.